guys, it's Hortsy Girl 1, 2, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 60, 60, 69, and today I'm going to show you how to tack up a horse. Look at me. I'm riding a horse. And another horse. And another horse. I'm practically an Olympian. So before you put the tack on, don't even bother touching your horse with a brush. I mean, he's just going to get dirty while you ride him anyway. First, you want to put on the saddle pad. Now for this, you're going to want to put it as far back on the horse's body as possible to relieve the horse's withers from any pressure and instead mount all the pressure onto his back legs. Next, you want to put on the bridle. Now this goes on like this, right? Wrong! That's abuse! In order to do this correctly, you turn the bridle so the bit is facing the hind end of the horse to make sure the back is in maximum comfort. Now, onto the girth. Now this piece is supposed to be in leather, right? Wrong! That's abuse! This is nothing but a strangulation device that wraps around the horse's stomach so they can't breathe while you're riding them. Thanks, but I'd rather ride without Satan attached to my bridle. Next, we have to put on the bridle. Now the bridle goes on like this, right? Wrong! That's abuse! I have made the saddle out of soft fabric to ensure that my horse is not a victim of leather abuse. The correct way to put on the saddle is to wrap the straps around the muzzle and simply hold on to the pommel. Next, we're going to put on the bonnet. Now, some people mistake this as an object that goes over the horse's ears, but that's abuse. Instead, you're going to turn it this way and wrap it around the horse's muzzle to prevent it from neighing, snorting, eating, coughing, and breathing. And last, but definitely not least, you're going to take it all off because it's abuse. Do not exit out just because i'm doing an outro okay i have things to say to you right now i have important information guess who forgot to do an outro again this is me i hope that you guys enjoyed that video and made you laugh made you giggle made you pee yourself a little oh please don't take any of this seriously i purposely spelled things wrong and purposely mislabeled things such as calling a saddle a bridle a bridle a saddle calling the front of the saddle a bit calling the bridal stirrups. Um, so I am going to be doing a Q&A. I think when I go to Palm Springs on spring break, I'm doing a dropping motorcycle. So I will probably film a Q&A there. So in the comments, I would love it if you guys would ask me questions, anything you're wondering, anything, anything at all, I will answer. Make it crazy, make it stupid, make it serious. I am a bladder, so I take in all of the battles. As if there wasn't enough logic in this video already. Last year username will be included in the video, hashtag robbery. And no, my hair has not always been this light. I have dyed it. I'm sorry that I haven't posted for two whole weeks. I like to say that I was busy, but I wasn't, I was just lazy. Yes, in the videos, that is me riding. No, I do not ride that pony anymore. So don't ask questions about them. If you liked this video, you give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, then you should probably go stick a stick up your butt hole. Just kidding. I love everybody. <laughs> You can subscribe if you would like to see more, and I would love it if you guys would comment if you want me to see anything. Hashtag to Jen Equestrian Connection. Also, thank you so much for all the DMs I've been getting. For some reason, I've been getting tons of DMs of you guys being lovely. So thank you. I love you all. I don't know what I'm saying anymore because I'm tired. Let's blow this popsicle scale. Oh, glazers, empty hearts, buying happy from shopping carts. Nothing but time to kill. Sipping like from bottom side skin. This is nothing but a strangulation device. And today, I'm going to show you how to tack up a horse. I'm going to show you how to tack up a horse. Before you put it in a gurgurka, you got a gurgurka. Correctly, you turn in order to do. Thanks, but I'd rather. I cleaned the kitty litter upstairs already. In the jungle, the mighty jungle. If you haven't got problems, I feel bad for your son. I got 99 problems and a bitch ain't one. And last, but definitely not, but definitely not least.